Good morning, world. Today I woke up feeling slightly ill, and I guess that's just what you get when you never really recover from a cold, but you keep kind of like pushing and going, and yeah, so <laughs> I've been partying pretty hard, as you guys have seen in my previous vlogs, and not really like partying till late or drinking, but I guess it's winter and it's cold and I'm tired, and then waking up early in the morning, so all of that contributed to me waking up today feeling like I just want to sleep this whole day, but I'm vlogging you don't want to see me just being in bed whole day so i was thinking what should i really do today since i'm not going anywhere and i'm just staying at home plan is to actually try and organize the space and show you maybe like little snippets of how i do it i am so happy to be waking up in my own bed even though not for that long but still it's quite nice and the thing what happens in my life is that i never get a chance to fully unpack and then pack for the next trip so I always like start unpacking unpack like 70% there's like 30% of stuff like that's left lying around and then when I come back from the trip I don't have time to sort out that so it kind of like accumulates and then obviously like I'm buying and receiving new things all the time so I need to organize where I live I need to sort out my wardrobe I need to get rid of some stuff because I'm not wearing them anymore I need to organize my makeup do some washing I guess that's just what we'll be doing today okay so some packages arrived for me this morning so let's see what's in these In this one I have Rapid Lash and Rapid Brow, Eyebrow Enhancing Serum and Eyelash Enhancing Serum. Wow, I'm going to be trying these. There is a lot of stuff in here. I've got some nail polish, some Sally Hansen nail polish. I've got some like um, nail care stuff like Maximum Growth. I'll be trying these tomorrow, I guess. Nail Grow Miracle. I used to love this as a student, was my go-to product. Vitamin E nail and cuticle oil. Got some bourgeois. This like chocolate bronzer. Do bronzing powder and highlighter. This is really popular. Okay now, it's time to tidy all of this up as well to add to my tidy pile, I guess. <laughs> Great fun. So I'm gonna go get dressed, make a cup of coffee, of course, you guys know me, and then start sorting out also this situation over here. Okay, you guys know how I have a pretty particular life philosophy, well, if you've been following what I'm doing, and one of, like, crucial parts of it is never to complain. I don't like complaining, and I don't like when people complain, because I just think it's like an unnecessary waste of energy. So, I don't know if I've done this on my YouTube channel, but I often challenge people to not complain for a month and that like every time you complain about something you should write it down in a little notebook and then at the end of the month you read what you've been complaining about. I think that's quite beneficial because you often realize that our problems are not 
often real problems. I mean, like, obviously there are real problems in everyone's lives, but we often complain about things such as missing a train, or train being delayed, or food not being salty enough, or internet not being fast enough. I'm guilty of that. But I really, really try not to complain. Like, I've been ill for a month and, well, on and off and it's just like I can't get rid of it because obviously I'm constantly on the go and like I, I just, I, I felt like basically what I was, <laughs> where I'm going with this is I was gonna switch on the camera and tell you, oh, I'm actually not feeling any better, I'm gonna go down and take some medicines which is a great thing because I'm a pharmacist and I know exactly what I need to take. But then I thought like, why should I be complaining? Like, who wants to watch a video where I'm like, oh... I'm so ill, poor me, and I'm ill because I was freaking partying at Victoria's Secret after party and then the next day I was partying at a YSL <laughs> party, so I think I pretty much caused it myself and I'm responsible for it, so uh, no one else is responsible for the fact that I'm ill and for me getting better. So what I'd like to say though is the end of the year and I would like to challenge all of you not to complain for one month or at least if you can't do it in December, do it in January. Try and not complain for one whole month. Let me know in the comments below if you're gonna take on my challenge and then let me know how you get it. So several hours later it's all tidy finally as you can see things are looking much much better much nicer i think about having a lot of stuff is that you can never actually like tidy easily so it takes hours and hours to tidy but finally everything's in its place and it's looking up and and it's much nicer to be around here so Now I'm free to Netflix and chill, actually. I still have my office to sort out, to organize, to get rid of a lot of mess. Still a few more hours to go. I know this is not the most fun vlog, probably, but I just have to get these things done. And you guys are following Vlogmas, so it's just as real as it gets. It's nearly midnight and basically this day is over. I know this vlog was probably not so much fun comparing to everything else that I've been doing this month and comparing to everything else you've been probably watching but this is just what it is so today I had to do kind of like 
computer work and to tidy my home but look how nice it is now i'm so happy because there's all of this space now and everything is organized now i can even clear out my wardrobe properly that's making me feel very happy because there's a lot more space around i hope you enjoyed seeing this side of my life as well and either way i will see you tomorrow bye